Hello, I'm Caitlin from ESPI Metals, and we have been receiving some questions from our customers about our materials and their properties. For the fourth and final test, I will bend each sheet 90, then 180 degrees, and try to flatten them back out to its original shape. So I'm going to bend the 1,000th 90 degrees. Bends easily, but can hold that shape pretty well, can flatten out. Bend it 180 pretty easily, you know, like regular paper. But like paper, when you try to bend it flat, it still has that crease in it and it's hard to get the crease out. Five thousandths, again pretty easy to bend 90 degrees and can hold the crease and hold that shape pretty well. Same bending it 180, it's kind of like folding a thick card and folding it flat the same as the one thousandths. You know, it, it still holds that bend but um, can go flat. 10,000. Pretty easy to bend in the 90 degrees, but harder to get that straight bend. And again, can go over in the 180, but it's harder to get that straight crease down. And bending it out flat. You can see that it's still kind of warped, but it does kind of go flat. 20. Holds the um, 90 degree bend quite well. A little bit harder to fold in a 180 completely flat, um, but it does, it can go pretty flat. And then flat out again. It's easier because you couldn't get that crease as nice, but still you can see there's a bit of a warp. And then for the 40, it's a bit harder, but you can get it to go. There's the 90 degrees. And the 180, a little bit harder to do, but you can get it to go over all the way. It's about as far as I can get it. And then getting it out flat is a bit harder to do. But if you really work with it, you can get it to go about, about this flat. <laughs> Hopefully this has answered some of the questions you might have had. If not, feel free to contact our office by phone or email. Thank you for watching.